Hi, I'm Tyler, project manager and lighting director here at Sweet Tree Productions. Today, I'm here to give you a little bit of basic knowledge about DMX daisy chaining fixtures, okay? So, there's really only a couple times where you need to use this, and that's just to set these on a standalone type mode, okay? So, uh, we're just going to demonstrate this with four mega bars, but we can do this with any type of fixtures that are in our inventory. Um, so, first things first. We've got all four of them. We've got power. So we're, the way Daisy Chaining works, we have one master, which is this one right here. And then these are going to be our slave. So we've got power going to our master. We're going to go ahead and you have to use DMX cables, which is what I have wrapped around me right here. So we're going to go from the DMX out on the first fixture to the DMX in on the second and just continue down the, down the row daisy chaining them uh, all together. Now this this works great for any type of uplining or just a event where it's really not necessary to have someone uh, working the lights the, during the show or anything like that. Um, and it still gives you that cool effect and they're all synced up and that's that's more professional than anything is you know if everybody's doing the same thing at the same time. Okay, so master, slaves, they're all chained together now with the DMX. So like I said, out on the first, in, out, in, out, in, and that's our chain. So now with these, they have uh, the AC out on them so we can power all these off of one cable. And as you can tell, they all just came on there. So we're going to go to our first uh, mega bar here. We're going to start going through uh, the... Uh, different programs. We'll pick a program we want. Nice color fade or something like that. Let's see here. Okay, this is a simple little program here. And as you can tell, they're all changing. This is the one that's controlling them because that's a program. And what we do on the rest of these, and which I've already gone through and done, is we set the DMX address, which is A001. And we set every single fixture after the first one to so channel 1. So these are all the slaves. So if it's a slave, it's on DMX channel 1. And if it's a master, it's on the program, whatever that program may or may not be. Okay? And as you can tell, all of these mega bars are doing the exact same thing at the exact same time. It does a great effect, it looks awesome, and it looks more professional because they're all doing the same thing at the same time, and uh, it's a cleaner look. So uh, very simple to do. If you have any questions, feel free to uh, shoot us an email or give us a call, and we'll be happy to help you out. Thanks for joining us here at Sweet Tree Productions.